Danelle, welcome to Morecambe. Firstly, tell us how you feel now that you're here. Um, I'm happy to get it over the line. Obviously, it's an opportunity in League One and I'm just excited to be here and excited to get started. You've been in and around the club t today. Tell us your first impressions. I think it's a, it's a great club, obviously great facilities. I've seen the stadium, very modern. I've heard a lot that it gets packed out during during the games and stuff and the support's, the support's been good this season. So I think I'm in a good place to, to carry on for the rest of the season. You're only a, a young age, but you've had plenty of experience across the EFL already in League Two. Talk us through your times at Carlisle and Tranmere and how much you enjoyed those times there. Obviously, um, Carlisle was my first start in professional football. Obviously, I had a short, short spell there on loan. Um, it went well. I think I learned a lot there. Valuable lessons, obviously, maturing as a player, living by myself and stuff. And then I went back in the summer to Southampton and decided to come back to League Two for one more stint. And um, I went to Tramway Rovers, where I enjoyed my time thoroughly there. Um, I played alongside some good players, obviously, a mix of experience with a young side. So, with it being a young side, it allowed me to express my, my leadership qualities more and to, to, to grow in myself and um, to show what I can do. And I think, I think I've done it right there, hence why I had the interest for Morecambe and, and clubs. So, yeah, I just think every year I've just got better. And I think it's just about taking the next step up and taking each challenge um, one at a time when they come. How much do you think you've developed as a player from your first days at Carlisle to now? I think immensely, you know. I think um, I still am developing. I've still developed a lot, but I don't like to, to, to think I'm the complete article yet because I'm still learning, you know. I think I'm going to learn a lot more under the new gaffer here. And ultimately, that's why I've come here to, to test myself. This is a higher level. I know it's going to be harder. It's going to be a challenge, obviously. The team are near the bottom bottom half of the table, but they've they've got good momentum. They've been doing well. They've been getting results in the last two games, which I've which I've noticed. And and I'm here to fight. I think that will show another side of my game. Obviously, having to fight. Um, obviously, at Carla, I was in a similar situation, and I think it's about belief. Um, how you are as a character around the building, you know. I think um, all those things will, will, will come into play and it's about me embracing the challenge and, and doing my best where I can. You talk about embracing the challenge. Obviously, this is your first experience now in League One. How much are you looking forward to making that next step up? Yeah, yeah, definitely. I think um, I'm aware of what's, what's ahead of me and the, the expectations and stuff. And I don't think um, I should be too worried. I think anything, I should be excited, you know. It's going to give me a, another chance to to express myself on another platform, you know. Um, I love defending and I think I've come to a great club, so if anything, I see it as a challenge and one that I should take with both hands and, and do my best and always give 110% because at the end of the day, it's only going to make me a better player. And I know you've spoken with the, with the manager, Derek Adams, today. What's he said to you briefly? Um, not much, just I, I was wanted from beforehand, so, so I've spoken to him beforehand and stuff. Um, but yeah, he's just, he's just told me they're going to look after me, you know. I'm here, I don't need much um, reassurance. I'm going to give my best and I'm sure they'll look after me. I think I should let, um, let myself get comfortable and stuff and then once I'm on the pitch, if I do my best, I'm sure, sure things will go well. And I've heard of a great bunch of lads here, so hopefully together we can do a good job. And lastly, for fans that maybe haven't seen you play before, what can they expect from you to sort of describe your own style of play? My style of player? Um, I always like to get asked this question, I don't know what to say. I think I like to do a bit of everything, you know. Um, first and foremost, I'm a defender, so I like to defend, I love to defend. I, 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 I thrive to get um, clean sheets, I love clean sheets, um, I love attacking the ball. I've been trying to add goals to my game at first team level, so I think I'm good in, in both boxes. Um, I'm a good, I think I'm a decent leader, you know, I try to big other people up, make sure the team stays together and stuff. Um, I like to play football, so I like to bring the ball down and, and try build from the back when, when necessary and stuff. But I think I'm just I always give 120%. You can always see that when I play. I play with passion. Um, I, like, I, like, I like to not get beat, so I'm very big with tackles and stuff. But I think I, think I can add, add something to the team, you know? Um, but yeah. That's just me in a nutshell, really. Well, welcome to the club and best of luck. Thank you very much.